In this video, we are demonstrating the cause and effects on an Aries Netlink fire suppression and detection control panel. Now the first cause would be the activation of smoke detector that is addressed as one in the loop or could be the second smoke detector. Now before that, you can see on the digital screen all the parameters are zero presently except trouble that shows uh, three those are because the SLC2 is not connected for uh, time being we are connecting only SLC1 and so we will be concentrating on that now we shall proceed with smoke detectors activation which is done using a solo smoke detector testing kit now after the smoke detector is activated the fire alarm or the fire strobe light should go on and after a delay of 120 seconds there will be a ventilation shutdown presently you can see that the green bulb is glowing that means that the ventilation is in on condition right now we will just proceed with the smoke detectors activation screen is on normal condition right now now you can see that there is an alarm on the photo the smoke detector which is the first component in the loop therefore you can also see the address that is loop 1001 it also gives you the location that is UPS room and then you can also see that there is an alarm that is alarm 1 and you can see that there is a countdown it started with 120 seconds therefore the activation or you can call it as a shutdown of the ventilation will happen in another 18 and odd seconds currently you can also see that there is an, a fire strobe light flashing so we will just wait for 120 seconds is currently come down to 70 and odd seconds and odd seconds to go for the ventilation to shut down ten more seconds Now I shall focus the camera on the ventilation bulbs. Now you can see that the ventilation is shut down so the bulb moves to off condition and the countdown stops. So that was the first cause and effect 